Now, I've been watching Wilbersoot for a while, and I even have some of his merch, okay? So don't mess with me. And this isn't me being an obsessive stan either, okay? I'm not obsessive, I just like his music, that's all. If you don't know what I mean by that, I have favourite songs, so here are my top five favourite songs. And I just want to say that even though the one I'm gonna start off with is on the bottom of the list, it's still my top five, okay? My top five. All of these are my favourite five. If you don't know, Wilbur Soot is a musician. He sings about women, and I find that interesting. Anyway, first First one on the top five list is Jubilee Line. <laughs> Everyone likes songs about jumping off rails in London, okay? <laughs> but seriously, it's a very good song. I have fond memories of it, even though it was released like last year. Oh, and I just want to say that, yes, I know in a video I did last year, I said that Saline Solution was one of my favorites, but I've just kind of fallen out of love with that. I don't listen to it that often anymore. So sorry, Saline Solution. <laughs> I'm, I'm really, I'm, I'm sorry. Anyway, I digress. Number Number two. I mean, sorry, not number two. Number four. I mean, number four. <laughs> Losing face. I like it for a lot of reasons, but I guess the main reason is because it's really a comedy song, but without the comedy. Wilbur Soot, when he's singing seriously, he does mostly acoustic songs. But when he does comedy songs, it's, you know, there's effects on it. There's other instruments and stuff. Look, Frog is Pog. Yes, I still have it. I didn't just throw it away after the recording, you little idiot. Now, from this point on, you can start to see a pattern, okay? Number three is Sid. Since I Saw Vienna. Since I Saw Vienna also seems to relate to me on a very personal level. Actually, almost all of Wilbur Soot's songs seem to relate to me on a personal level. It seems like every song he puts out somehow relates to me. Love Joy as well, like every single song they seem to sing about some part in my life. It, it's weird. Walking around my room with my arm in the air all the time is so exhausting. And you want to know why I do it? You want to know why? It's because I want my videos to appear more like a vlog even when they are Aunt. And I think it's also good for YouTube not to turn off my comments. Oh, by the way, if you don't know, YouTube likes to turn off comments of people who are under 16, which unfortunately includes me. So if YouTube actually turns off comments, please join the Discord in the description below, because that way I can actually talk to you. Also, make sure to like and subscribe. We, we can't forget those things. Anyway, on with the video. So, in Wilbur's Lost EP, Maybe I Was Boring, one of my favourite songs from there, and the number two spot goes to to for the memories. Now it's hard to find the track list on this because for some reason they're all in the same song that goes for like 16 minutes. It's not mixed together, they just cut and then it starts, so there must have been some mixing issue there. So there are four songs on the EP. The first one is Maybe I Was Boring. The second one is For the Memories, which is my favourite one. The third one is called White Wine in the Weatherspoons. And the fourth one is called It's All Futile, It's All Pointless, which I also really enjoy. So yeah, consider the those my honourable mentions for today's video. The entire EP was something that I used to listen to earlier this year. Around January and February, maybe even May. And that would also be something I'd listen to when I was filming the one year anniversary for the unnamed vlog series. So yeah, maybe I was boring has a place in the hashtag gas mask history. So now you may be wondering, hashtag gas mask, what is your number one favourite Wilbur Soot song? It can't be anything from maybe I was boring because those are all or either honourable mentions or the second spot which is for the memories. Could it be one of Wilbur Soot's comedy songs? Or could it be something a part of the Incel series? Well it's neither of those things because my favourite Wilbur Soot song of all time is La Jolla. Yes, La Jolla is my overall favourite Wilbur Soot song. And it resonates with me on a huge level. It seems to be singing about my life again. And there's also a bit at the end that might relate to the editor Wilbur ARG. I don't see how but it could relate relate to it, maybe? I, I, I'm not quite sure. Anyway, guys, those were my top five favourite songs. You didn't really have a reason to watch this. I just wanted to rant about my favourite Wilbur Soot songs. If you like this kind of content, please subscribe. We're almost at 200 subscribers and I'm thinking of doing a Q&A. So if that's something you want to watch, then definitely, definitely subscribe. And also, if you want to participate in the Q&A, join the Discord server. See ya! I gotta go now and why are you still here?